Dubai Magnetology Dr. Sam Osmanagic, PhD, researcher of ancient pyramid technology, visited the United Arab Emirates, or more specifically, the most advanced emirate of Dubai. He was given the opportunity to become familiar with magnetic technology and its modern-day inventors and promoters. Planet Earth is a gigantic magnet the magnetic field on the surface of the planet, known as the geomagnetic field, is created by its internal structure. The geomagnetism of the Earth is influenced by the magnetic field of the Moon, other planets of the solar system, as well as the Sun's solar plasma and magnetic storms. All of these elements create a delicate and very refined mechanism. Should there occur a change in any of these elements, the entire mechanism could collapse on top of human civilization and life on Earth's surface in general. Over the last few centuries, man has brought about just such changes with excessive mining and the use of harmful materials. Magnetology is a scientific discipline which researches ways to correct such imbalances of the geomagnetic poles of the Earth and to bring their benefits back to at least the local level. The most significant contribution to the development of magnetology was provided by Russian scientists beginning in the 1960s through dozens of scientific institutes in what was then the USSR. With the formation of the Rosika Corona Company, Yuri Takienko brought these efforts together and more than 500 research projects in various fields were carried out with the support of the Russian government. In 1996, together with Junid Mohamed Khoury of Dubai, Professor Takyenko formed a magnetic technologies company in Dubai for further promotion of this technology throughout the world. Yuri Takyenko first got his degree at the Polytechnical Institute at the University of St. Petersburg, and for his fruitful scientific work, the Russian Academy of Sciences awarded him the honorary title of professor in 1992. Everyone today in the Arab world uses this title when addressing him, and he is the recipient of many Russian honors. Junid Khoury, on the other hand, got his degree at Al Ain University. He is a highly respected manager in Dubai and belongs to one of the oldest families in the Emirates. Originally, all the phenomena on our planet had a polar structure. Darkness, light, good, evil, black, white, plus and minus. If, for example, we were able to take a glass of water from the unpolluted Bosnian River a thousand years ago and compared it with a glass of water taken now in the 21st century, we would easily be able to see a difference between them. In the former, all the molecules of water would have the regular plus-minus arrangement. In the latter, the molecules are in disarray, chaotically distributed. This is a classic example of dead water in terms of energy. We can purify it, but the original organization of the molecules cannot be obtained. Is there a solution for this? The Russian genius Professor Takyenko has invented a special magnetic system which enables the correction of this fatal human mistake. The water is magnetized and the molecules regroup into a strict order and the water again becomes biologically active or alive. After taking such magnetic or magnetized water, our body gets energy and becomes capable biologically to fight off various diseases. Indeed, we could compare our body to the two glasses of water. It's clear that we need to attempt to become energetically alive again, alive in terms of energy. A simple experiment can be made with two seeds. One of them can be watered with the magnetized water and the other with plain tap water. The difference is enormous. Ripening, growth, biological characteristics, fragrance, color, size, all are superior with the use of magnetized water. Magnetized water sifts out harmful material, heavy metals, 
toxins, and in the living organism, the living energized water begins to flow. The comparison of leaves from plants planted at the same time, with the only difference of the use of tap water on the left and magnetic or magnetized water on the right. Magnetic water acts positively on the external and internal organs of the human body. Examples of the use of magnetic water are almost unlimited. Desalinization, cleanup of rivers, lakes, water supplies and sewage systems, and in the construction industry, vastly improved characteristics of concrete, agriculture, biotechnology and medicine. However, magnetology can be applied in numerous other materials to correct and advance significantly their molecular structure – petroleum, seeds, foods, even alcohol and tobacco – with the reduction of toxic materials. Junied showed Dr. Sam examples of fields of grain which were treated with magnetic technology next to neighboring fields which had no such treatment. Their yields were improved by 30 or 50 percent and sometimes even more than doubled with the use of magnetized water. Medicine could experience revolutionary changes with the application of magnetic technology with measurable results in the treatment of all, even the most serious illnesses. The polluted cities we live in are crammed with positive ions which contribute to causing headaches, general weakness, fatigue, stress and all of the very serious illnesses. On the other hand, places with an abundance of negative ions, such as waterfalls, places after storms and rain or natural caves, give instant help for better breathing, mood and a higher level of energy. An abundance of negative ions occurs when the electron unhooks from the atom and attaches to another molecule, but also when a neutral molecule attracts it with its power of attraction. In the first years of his work in Dubai and Abu Dhabi, Professor Takienko promoted and through the Magnetic Technologies firm installed 300 systems for the production of magnetic water on farms and estates with a total of 8,100 square kilometers. Then, in 1993, he designed the first magnetic generator for aerial dispersal of negative ions. The combination of these two sources for the correction of negative ions led to miraculous changes in the vegetation and the climate in the Desert Dry Emirates. The harvest grew by 30 to 60 percent, the ripening period was shortened by 20 days, the quantity of seeding was cut in half for the same surface, the use of fertilizer was decreased by half and the use of water for irrigation was also decreased by half. The average rainfall in the Emirates over the preceding 30-year period prior to the use of Takienko's technology amounted to 113.1 mm per year. The first three years after the use of magnetic technology, the level of rainfall reached 238.4 mm, that's over twice more than before. By 2019, the professor had developed the technology which could create an emission of millions of negative ions in the atmosphere, creating magnetic clouds and magnetic rain. This means a speeding up of natural processes without harmful consequences to the environment or for people, with all the benefits mentioned above. The rulers of the Emirates use magnetic water in their luxurious residences, but this is still not a state project. It was stopped when they realized that the application of this technology was a threat to the pharmaceutical and all the other highly profitable and harmful industries, supposedly because of the fact that it came from their competitors, the Russians. Professor Takienko and his colleagues attended a lecture by Dr. Sam Osmanigich in Dubai on April 3, 2012. He listened attentively to the three-hour story about the pyramids in the world and the resistance of government institutions in China, the Canary Islands, Mauritius and Bolivia, among others to even recognize their existence and their age. He heard the facts about the development of the interdisciplinary project researching the Bosnian Valley of the Pyramids and the attacks orchestrated on the foundation by groups from the cultural establishment of Bosnia, but also the pressures from London, Boston and Cairo to stop the project of the Bosnian Pyramids. After Dr. Sam's lecture, he came up to him, clearly excited and emotional. He said, I understand you 1000%. I am a soldier and you are the Marshal General.